Hi everybody and welcome back to Ukrainian Gaming, I'm Andrew and today we continue our game with um, China in uh, a normal content map, deity, standard speed. So let's continue next turn. Uh, we have uh, two cities. Uh, we are trying also to befriend uh, with um, uh, Korea, but uh, that might take some time. I'm not sure if I will manage, but I will do my best, of course. And uh, yeah. Last but not least, we have to define a strategy to strongly expand while we have a lot of time and space. Uh, we should really um, deliver as much cities as possible. So my idea would be the following. We have really a, a lot of possibilities at the moment. Um, the first spot I want to get is uh, some place where I can also reach some part of this nature wonder. Um, and that means I might uh, get a, uh, found a city over this stone resource, which will be my most likely third city. After that, I need three tiles and then I can found another city that could be my coastal city. And uh, here that would be a perfect spot also. Uh, maybe let me take uh, city center. Okay, um, there is not so much else to do because I don't know what's there. This is all desert, so I'm, it might be very difficult. Um, then the, the next city should be close to other resources. And actually, uh, that this would be a very nice place because I would have here an harbor, uh, a lot of uh, wheat uh, and citrus right away. The harbor would be close to the city center and then I can use his uh, bonus here uh, instead of the wheat that I might collect for example uh, then we have another area here we have great we have a great opportunity unfortunately always uh, uh, close to the to the sea because I cannot found uh, further away but I would uh, create uh, I would like to uh, found the city here probably not my priority but still because my next city will be in this very very close area where I can then create an arbor here between the fish and uh, and the purse and here I would have fresh water I would have mountains for another district here a scientific district probably and uh, that's going to be nice probably this is going to be my second colony so one two three four ah uh, no one two three four five maybe maybe i might change my mind uh, along the way i'm used to do that okay so our builder arrived almost in place to work the horses we, we have uh, we have a new technology which is also good okay let's take the horses now and now shanghai can work on horses and soon we will have also uh, some cattle i'm going to buy this uh, right away i'm not going to wait for the culture to get it because it's important and now we have to think if we want to defend our set uh, and we want archers so I would go directly to the archery or go to the masonry which will give us the possibility to build a great wall the pyramids which are also very good because we are China so our workers can uh, boost uh, any other um ancient or classical wonder until 15 percent okay and this grants a free builder and all builders can be an extra improvement which means we are already china we already have four improvement so we start with an extra improvement with the pyramids we would have five improvements and uh, that could really be a game changer in my opinion but i would need to build a quarry that i can build here so yeah, I, I, I'm going to the, I'm going for archery. I try to be defensive and conservative here uh, because I don't trust Korea. But let's see. I will try anyways to be the pyramids. That's my that's what I try. I will try to do. Buenos Aires, okay. And Ayutaya give us a one envoy, which is great. And wait a moment, wait a minute. I I have I have done a mistake here. Yeah. I was working the tile of horses while uh, this tile of forest that burned is a 6-3-3, which is amazing. I have no amenities, 
That's because the citrus is going directly to Korea. I'm trying to bribe them, let's say. Let's see if it works. Uh, anyways, we are going to get soon, let me see, pears and tobacco. So we will fix this. I will fix this. But anyways, let's continue now. Uh, cattle. And we go south. Also here. I'm not sure if I can maybe... No, it will take too much time. I'm not going to do that. Maybe I can try to kill this uh, um, Barbaria camp with my scouts because I still have the discipline and maybe I will keep it uh, uh, for a little while. Even if we have the early empire, which is great. I could use the Limitane loyalty. I don't need it. Uh, naval units. I don't need it. Survey. I don't need it. I keep the discipline. Uh, Furthermore, I don't have uh, yet a pantheon, so I must keep the god king just for a little while. Then I will move directly to craftsman, craftsmanship. So in six turns, I will move to colonization, and that's good. Let's appoint Magnus as a as a, um, um, governor in Xi'an, and let's continue. Let me just quickly see I, if I remember correctly. How can I build? I need to check one thing, guys. Yeah, exactly. I would need to build a government plaza. Uh, so I need craftsmanship and state work first. I'm used to playing Italian, so <laughs> I do not recognize the names of the districts, guys. Anyways, let's fortify our units because we have to, to attack them uh, together. Maybe also with uh, a flanking bonus if it may. Actually, I'm not even sure if those two guys can get a flanking bonus. Uh, anyways, I will discover it, but I have nothing to lose anyways. Let's continue. And the city-state is helping me here. Okay, so I could give now to my capital three gold and one science, which is not bad. Or I could go to Shanghai and get a plus one food and plus one production. And I think I will go in this direction. This is my strategy at the moment. And why not? So... The second slinger is ready, it will stay behind the river in the forest. Uh, those guys attacked the unit of, uh, oh, wow, of Spearman. I'm going to wait until they get attacked again and again, and then maybe we'll try to get them. Now that everything is in place, I might take a settler, but no, I'm not going to do it. I am actually working on another builder, and here, I am also working on a builder. I don't have yet the 30% is going to happen in five turns. So let's let's change it. Let's change it. Let's take a monument for 10 turns. I don't need a granary. I don't need a granary either, but a monument can help for uh, can help with culture. So let's have this very strange strategy, which I never use and probably it will lead me to <laughs> to a dishonorable defeat, but I'm gonna try that. Let's see. Let's wait and see. Do you have enough gold for the cattle? Please. Yes, I do. That's wonderful. Okay, I can get a plus one production. Let me see, which is great. Um, nevertheless, if I take this resource, I would get 29 food. Wow. Let's let's keep the half housing and the production. It's going to be better. And now let me have a look here. Yeah, that's great. Uh, I, it was not necessary, but maybe Xi'an can use it for a little moment. Maybe. No, because there is there is no there is no border next. There is no border between Xi'an and Shanghai, so I cannot sw switch the. Tiles. Is it going here? Oh, it's going quite well. So now let me attack. Now let's wait just one more turn. <laughs> just one more turn. Hanging gardens completed. And uh, now one and two. And it's done. We have the money. We have the experience. We didn't risk anything. Great move. I'm very happy. 
I'm very, very happy. Okay. So now Xiang has five empl employees, <laughs> citizens. Uh, that means enough with food. Let's boost production because we are entering uh, in a different phase. Not for Shanghai. Shanghai remains uh, as I said. And uh, let's continue. Okay. This is going to be interesting because I need probably to kick their ass here and maybe an archer would be useful. Next turn. Okay, craftsmanship. Now let's look. Uh, let's look at the policies because are we that? Oh man! Just a second. Yeah, 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 yeah. I, I have the pantheon. Thanks God. I can do that. I can do that. Let me take the ilkum right away. And regarding discipline, I could have production towards units which I don't need, so discipline can remain. Let's do this. In two turns we will have a builder, and in five turns we will also have another builder, which is going to be great. Now let's pick the Pantheon very carefully, because uh, the Monument to the Gods could boost once again the bonus of China towards uh, ancient and classical wonders. But, huh, is it what we need? Is it what we need? Let me think. I have to keep in mind that I want to go for a scientific victory and uh, the Divine Spark is providing with a plus one great person point for theatres and libraries. So the theatres with an amphitheatre and campuses with a library and um, uh, that's not bad at all. That's not bad at all. It's really giving a, uh, it's giving a, it's giving a surplus of points. Uh, I would go otherwise for the plus 15% for the wonders, but it's very situational. Uh, when I will be in the Middle Ages, that would be completely useless. Why? But if I take the Divine Spark, then in the Middle Ages, this will be even better because I will have uh, a lot of libraries, hopefully. So let's try that. And let's move also Slinger here to the north. Maybe it's a good idea. I need now another, uh, not another envoy, but state war for another governor. Yeah, and I need a district to to boost this. Okay, fine. Let's continue. We might figure it out later. Stonehenge has been built. Barbarian Sing Xiang. Let's kick them. Yes. Okay. Good. Now we can go back to normality here, and I'll say, let's continue. Good. Uh, so now this guy is going to be uh, an archer. This guy continues. And the oracle has been built. Wow, they, they are really so fast. What I would like to see is um, where, do, where do we have, where do we have um, iron? And I have 20 horses. I'm going to try to do a deal with uh, with Korea. I'm going to try to say, okay, give me all your gold. They say no. Uh, tell me what's better for you for 30 turns, 7 per turn. Okay, accepted. They are going to uh, flood us with gold and we will use this gold to develop faster. Production. Now, we completed a monument. Let's go for the builder and let's continue. Brilliant. <sighs> That's not going to be funny with them. Classical era. And we enter in a golden age, if, I, if I'm not wrong. I hope I'm not wrong. <laughs> and as I thought, those guys are starting already with horses. That's very bad. Now we're in a normal era. Absolutely normal. So, my mistake. Um, otherwise, we'd have picked the monumentality, but uh, that's okay. Let's keep the free inquiry for the Eureka, even if it's not going to help us a lot. And Shanghai is also getting a builder. Now, let's say to the scouts, uh, automat, uh, automat, automat. Yes, that's great. 
And let's go ahead. Another one. Wow. <laughs> I hate you guys. That's 45 here. I cannot stand them all together. I need really to, to do it in a different way. Nah, uh, my warrior is already gone, so I obviously need all my firepower, so we need another archer, and it's going to be difficult now. It's going to be difficult, they, they are coming also from north, they're approaching from north, they will destroy the, the farm, it's going to be very annoying. Thanks God, we um, now have iron here, uh, let's see what else. Let's go for mathematics. Wow. I cannot believe this is happening. Okay, we need a spearman. And of course, I'm going to rush down the production because Magnus is in the in town, so I will really boost it. Um, I need to go get back to Xi'an and defend with this archer. I cannot play the hero because this is not going to work. Next. Wonderful. And now let me think where I could move. So uh, for sure, a, a mine will not harm. Let's see if this guy comes here and we can try to tackle him. In the meantime, Korea is always really bad. And okay, we have a crazy barbarian camp. It's really, it's really getting uh, berserk. We need discipline at every cost, and now we can also get the the, the production in every city because I want to get us to the government plaza. So the spearman is ready. I can start attacking with my uh, arrows. And this guy here is going to build uh, a mine. And let me see if I can now micromanage a little bit better. I think this is what we can do. That's it. Let's go for political philosophy. Wait. Uh, wait. And let's choose the production in our capital. And I want the government plaza. And where I put the government plaza, this is going to be very important because uh, it will affect also our um, districts nearby. And I think I'm going to put it here uh, because I will then build the districts around this area. For example, here we might have a great um, a production site, an industrial area, because we might have now, well, I, ca I cannot build a dam here. I have to see. If I put it here, then I will have only three. No, let's put it here. Let's do it here. And let's focus on production. The governor now is getting a promotion. Settlers trained in the city do not consume population back. And next turn. Okay, so the of course the combo spearmen and uh, uh, archers is working pretty well, of course. But we need to 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 be really aggressive, and uh, we don't have to give them any sort of room for for pillaging, even if it's very difficult. I need to destroy this camp as up. Now we have another builder. Let me check uh, Shanghai because we have one to. Uh, uh, three already this is what we need we need amenities absolutely we need a lot of amenities otherwise we're going to be really that's going to be very bad um let's work on a campus uh, because this city is just perfect for a campus and yeah i'm gonna be ha i'm gonna get it close to the capital and this will be another district probably um let's see Let's work on a campus in Shanghai. 
here are mine. Next one. This guy has a, has a bow, so the suicide tactic will not work. But probably my archer can, can attack this. And this is a victory. Great, very good, very good, very good. Now, mm, let's move already at the builder so that he can fix the rest. And here we have three boosts. Mm. We need to destroy all the forests around the Xihan, and uh, this is a very good one. But I think we can all we can still do something here nearby. I, I think I don't need this forest. I will chop it anyways. Um, next turn, let's play our last turn for today. Wonderful. Fantastic, really. This is great. Very good. Okay, ladies and gentlemen, thank you for watching. This video was not so expansionist, but uh, we, 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 we put all our ducks in a row and uh, everything is in, in place. Uh, we will just need to get the political philosophy and uh, in the government plaza i think i can't remember if i can already build the um, structure that will gi that will give a, a builder for each of my cities but anyways i have magnus in place i have the right cards i can start colonizing the continent it's the turn 55 we have only two cities but well developed the koreans are not so dangerous for the moment even if look at their science uh, they are nine times bigger than us. Look at the culture. They're really four, uh, three times bigger than us. Even more, it's obvious that uh, they will be very tough to defeat. But we have time. We have a strategy. We're going to follow it. Thank you for watching, guys. If you appreciated this video, please leave a thumbs up. If you like this kind of games and strategy game, grand strategy game, please just subscribe. And uh, I will keep posting in the next uh, days and weeks. Anyways, thank you for watching. I wish you a great day. See you next time.